wrap up. <laughs> so um, you was sort of, you made the, the news cycle like around the holidays for oh. some of your philanthropic work. Yeah. Um, I read about um, you going to a Atlanta area Kroger and handing out some gift cards. Yes, uh, just, just talk about <laughs> what led you, because obviously during the pandemic and the holidays, you know, there's a lot of people in need. So how did that, how did that make you feel? It felt great, but I'm gonna tell you, we do, I do it, or we do this all year long. Uh -huh. Like we we give all year long, but we don't never talk about it. Right. So this just happened to be caught and saw because it was with a group of us. It was a lot of us together. So I think that's the difference or the dynamic is because we do this all year long. Our, I mean, I tell you about a lot of things we do from buying cars for friends, from our employees buying, doing um, things from um, uh, uh, honeymoons, that kind of thing. We do a lot for a lot of people, different people. I mean, from uh, my mom, we retired her and my dad, they don't even work anymore. Um, that kind of thing. So we, we in our church, our church is completely happy. They don't have to worry about a whole lot of anything. So, you know, this, we've been doing this for a long, long time too. So it just got, it just happened to be caught. So it, it made us feel really good. At the same time, it caught us doing it. I didn't think it was, we didn't know it was gonna catch fire like that. It wasn't, right. it wasn't done for a publicity. It was done because that's just naturally who we are, mm -hmm. you know? 